Okay, I've had a little bit of a break from doing videos and put, putting videos together and stuff. And then um, <laughs> I needed it, man, after that last video. Like, that really put me over the edge. I've been playing a little bit of State of Decay, man, and I've been uh, just, just chilling out and relaxing. I want to get this out of the way first, man, because um, if any of you guys are on Twitter, follow me on Twitter, at WasFPS. And if you can, just drop me a like on the video, man, it really helps me out, and it helps the channel out as well. Right, so the Milano. Now, this nice positive one, man. Nice positive video. I really, really like this weapon, man. It's definitely up there for me in like the top SMGs. There's something about this. It sort of feels like a hybrid assault rifle. Like the low recoil, man. I just like this weapon. And when I dropped um, like a scope on it, which I think was the micro reflex, it changed as well, man. It got a lot better. But straight off the bat when I was using this, I'm sure I had a blueprint for this one. I, I, I can't remember. I'm sure I did. But I just like this gun, man. It just works. I like the mobility of it. I, there's just something about it that I really like. And I liked it in the beta as well. But if I remember right, in the beta, it was quite strong. And I'm sure that, that the nerf did. But the nerf, it's not so bad. Like, it is a weapon that I would go back to and use again. But there's one thing that does lay down. It is the damage. Like, it, like, like you can put people down. You know what I mean? Of course, but there is better SMGs to use over the, like the Milano. But it's it's something that I would go back to, especially if I'm playing like a combine arms map, because this gun works on combine arms for me better than some other SMGs, as you can imagine. But um, I will go back to this one. I, I, I hope they do give it a little bit of a buff, to be honest. Like on the damage, it's, the damage is a bit low. You know what I mean? It's not like it's something where you choose something else over this 100% rather than using the Milano. So I, I, I'd like him just to give it a little bit of a buff. I mean, I'd like a lot of weapon balancing in this game. Do you know what I mean? But I will show you the class as usual, man. I'm guessing you got your own, but I will show you mine anyway. Okay, so the Milano class that I was working, first of all, just look at this, man. This is gold. <laughs> do you know what I mean? This, this is what I'm saying, man. This sort of stuff needs fixing. But yeah, optic, micro flex, LED. The muzzle was a sound suppressor. The barrel is the Task Force 10.6 inch barrel. Um, under barrel, field agent grip. A magazine is the Salvo 55 rim fast mags. That's the glass that I was using for the Milano. But yeah, man, look, it's <laughs> ridiculous. <laughs> so yeah, give this one a try, man. If you got anything better, then you tell me. And I will try it, man. I always try people's classes. Like, I, I like to change things up just a little bit. But I probably would say that this is probably, for me, the best balanced SMG in the game. And that's probably going to be the title of the, of the video, man. Because I think anybody could pick this up and just use it. It just works, man. It just feels good. But I do want to talk about some of the stuff, man, in this video. Um, as you guys know, man, I like to talk about the good a little bit. Then I'll put a class up for you if you want to use it. There's some, and I like to t talk about stuff that's in the community and stuff that's happening at the moment. There's one thing that's happening. I understand that we've got COVID and everything and stuff. And things are quite limited and stuff. But, um... There's no really no patches going out for this game, man. Like, I remember back in the day when, like, there was a massive deal. So, like, something happened, man, with um, the developers for Infinity Ward, like, Vin Sampella and stuff. And them guys, like, left left Infinity Ward and started respawn up. And there's a massive, massive lawsuit. And Modern Warfare 2, it didn't get updated for, like, a year or, or maybe two years. I can't remember now. But there was not a single update that went out for that game. Like the way that the game launched, that was what you got. It was, I mean, that that was it. You dealt with things. But back in them days, there was no like guns added onto the game. Whatever was in the base game, that was it. But you had enough stuff to, to keep you going, man. You had enough maps. You had enough like enough guns to keep you going all through the year. It's not like that they, these days. It's different. We started. It's like a live service that that we pay for. But some like this game, man. There's things that do need fixing in this game. And as you all know, the skill-based matchmaking is going to be the main thing for me because that, 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 that killed me, man, the other day. I'll be honest. But there is other things, man. Like, we need some, we need a weapon balance. Some some guns need a buff. Some guns need a nerf. They need to be throwing some patch updates out, man. And there's, like, graphic glitches in the game, on PC especially. There is some little things I've noticed on my game. But I've seen other people's videos where the skies, man, the skies just flashing on and off. And it's like, that needs fixing. And the camo progression is another thing, man. If you've noticed this, I noticed this when I was doing it. Like, I had to unlock, like, a gun, gold. And I think I left the game early, and then I logged out, got on the ne next day, started again. And 
the gold was locked again and I had to do one one challenge to unlock it again. So I backed out as soon as I did it. Same thing happened. Look, you have to finish the game for a all count and there's other camo bugs. Look, when trying to unlock the sledgehammer and the sword, in Modern Warfare, if you needed three kills without dying, you could just get those three kills and leave the game and it, and it would count towards challenge. But in this game, you have to complete the whole game. I mean, I understand that that's what they want you to do anyway, but you know, we got used to doing in Modern Warfare, jumping in, getting the challenge done, backing out, starting the game to unlock the weapon quicker. So, you know, it's, it's, it's little things like that. It's like, there's not a lot of activity on their Twitter, man. They don't really put anything out. The only thing that they put out is playlist. There's no updates being pushed out to fix things and to fix the camos, the weapons, a balance and stuff. There's nothing going out. There's one guy who does put stuff on who's, who's a dev. And he's, I think he's, he, 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 may, he may be the community manager. His name's Fox Sound FPS, I think his name is. And he does put some stuff on there. But, you know, it's not like them very, very active. I remember when Black Ops 4 dropped. That was being pushed all the time. Like, there was an update every week fixing some stuff. And like I did say, man, it may be due to COVID. But I'm not sure, man. But it, it, it's not looking good, man. People are getting angry in the community again. He's getting just furious about things. And it, it's not a good look, really. But let's jump back to the Milano. I have, I have said earlier that I think that this is the most balanced SMG in the game. I think if you don't really like using SMGs, this one's a good gun to use because it is like a hybrid. The recoil's low, the fire rate's quite low, and it's just an enjoyable gun, gun to use. If there's any tips for this gun, it'll probably be the long shot one again, man. I will put the video in the description for the SMG long shot. So spots on nuke turn where you can do these really, really fast. And everything else is just the same thing. Five kills without dying. I did those on nuke town. Um, top room and just floating about up and down the stairs and just you know picking people off getting the five kills restarting the challenge i will put the point blank kills video in the description as well so check that that one out that's how i got all point blank kills smgs i'm pretty sure the milano i didn't even look at those and i had those done somehow but i did come up with a method to get those done quicker than usual for all the tips for the smgs the videos that i have put out I'll just drop them in the description so you can check those out because the point blank kills and the lung shots are the main things to do with these weapons. So yeah man, like when you come to this one, I think you might enjoy this one. Try the class out, it's the class that I use, they just work for me. And hopefully we hear something from the devs about some future updates man, with some weapon balances and just some fixes in general man, because you know, there's not a lot of talk and then it doesn't look good man at the moment. Like I'm, you know, I'm already at the stage where I'm like, oh, can I play this for another year? But we'll see. And once again, man, thanks to everybody who's subscribing to the channel, man. My subs will just keep going up and up. It's crazy to see. And, like, I mean, I really appreciate everybody for doing that and watching the videos. So, yeah, man, nice one.